We proudly present Tyson Scholarship to this year's recipient, Colleen Elizabeth Fitzpatrick. This year's Amy Catherine Fitzpatrick Community Service Scholarship is proudly presented to Colleen Fitzpatrick. I'm very pleased to announce that this year's recipient from Holton High School is Derek Thomas. This year's winner is Ashley Bailey. Seniors, I wish I had awards for all of you. I know that you have worked so diligently to earn that English credit your senior year so that you have the right to sit up here with those silly hats on. <laughs> May you continue to delve, probe, and question as you continue with your academic pursuits. <coughs> Elliot Moore, you are Holton High School's next top English student. There are many outstanding social studies students in this year's senior class, and it is a pleasure for us to honor one of those students tonight. The recipient of the 2009 Social Studies Award is Elliot Morris. And I am very proud to award this scholarship to Patrick Longstaff, who I watched grow up to. Receiving the Health Service Foundation would like to invest in the future of our two of these college uh, students. Uh, Health Service Foundation um, every year gives those scholarships to an individual that is pursuing a course in um, some type of the health field. A $500 scholarship and a John Fitzpatrick scholarship to Colleen Fitzpatrick. Congratulations on getting unanimous decision after reading all of the applications that this year's recipient of the $250 scholarship is Sarah Cowell. The Sports Boosters are proud to be offering the athletic scholarship for a graduating male and female, ladies first. This year's female recipient is Courtney Putnam. And for the males this year, we actually have a tie. The uh, scholarship will actually be split between the two recipients. And this year's recipients are James Bates and Porter Jarvis. So the winning 
Barney Ward Senior MVP goes to James Bates. Senior Girl MVP is Laney Carroll. I'm usually up here asking for money, so <laughs> pleasure actually to give out some money. Where's Chris Putnam? Chris, we're going to do the buckets after this, okay? You're going to help out. Just want to make sure. If Mike Clark was here right now, he would say community band starts next Thursday in the park. Uh, but Mike Clark has always done a lot uh, for music in this town and donates towards a student that uh, has been very active uh, in the music program and also uh, plays in community band. And uh, this $300 award goes to Dustin Delano. We have students that dedicate tons of hours outside of the class. Uh, one that has done many, many hours with his service uh, in this auditorium, with lighting and uh, theater and everything else he does for us. Mr. Derek Thomas will receive $50 and another $100 for a service award. Well, my senior students this year were so exceptional, I just couldn't choose only one to honor tonight. In the interest of time and a long night ahead of us yet, I'm not going to give a long speech about each one of them. I just want to say I have been blessed to have had them as my students. They are all creative. They were productive far beyond my expectations. Courtney Kibler, Annie Nickerson, Emily Goldsmith, and Ryan Van Busker. Memorial Scholarship is given to a candidate who has demonstrated an interest in math and science. Heather, who is my sister, graduated from Holton High School and majored in electrical engineering at the University of Maine. This year's recipient is Ashir Abolish. Okay, and last, Science Fair. First prize. First place in the entire school. This is a team of three students who over the course of two years created a winning project. They are Ashir Abolish, Lowell Matthews, and Elliot Morris. As the 2007 recipient of the Harriet Johnstone Dunn Memorial Scholarship and the youngest of our four grandchildren, I'm here this evening to present my grandmother's scholarship on behalf of the rest of my family. As many are aware, my grandmother Harriet Dunn taught here at Holton High School for well over 30 years. I'm very pleased to announce that the two recipients of the 2009 Harriet Dunn Memorial Scholarship are Courtney Lynn Putnam and Margaret Ann Moody. We have another $1,000 scholarship for Kobe Botting. $1,000 scholarship for Sarah Gentle. Seeing this next name reminds me. $400 for scholars, Ellie Woodham. Congratulations, graduate. 